Welcome to this Windows 8 channel and uh, this is another tool for malware removal if uh, in our series that we are actually doing on tools to help you remove uh, malware viruses and uh, rootkits from your computer. Uh, this is from adlis.com. Now you might say, hey, haven't you posted this video? Um, I actually removed it for a few uh, weeks because a lot of people were complaining this is malware it is not um, but you know just to be safe and see the reason why people are saying it I wanted to test a few things and uh, actually what happens is if you are infected by malware sometimes the malware replaces links when you try to download software so if you um, download this and your computer starts saying hey this is malware don't open this that means you are infected and that means you need to download this from another computer you need to download it from a friend's computer It's very important this is not malware this is a very good piece of software to remove uh, viruses and malware from your computer the link to the download is in the description below the video so if you're looking for that link but it is adlice.com and I see that ICE is like ICE so I don't know if it's adlice maybe uh, software that you pronounce so uh, adlice.com slash softwares slash rogue killer the link is below the video anyways if you need to check it out now once you're on the page go way down way down way down down below premium but down below the PayPal donation buttons and you will see the download links are here with the gray buttons all you need to know is is your machine a 64 or 32 bit machine it's very important because you need to have the correct version if you're not sure they now have installers that actually will choose it for you automatically but um, if you know just click 64 32 bit version from the different links that you see here so once you download it you will have a download of a software and here you can see in my lower left corner rogue killer x64 because I wanted the 64 bits if you click the 32 bits you'll have rogue killer x32 make sure this is what you have it's very important once you've got it You'll click yes, you'll run it, and you'll open this software. It does a first verification where it will actually check the processes in your machine and the different items in memory to see if they're infected or not. Once that is done, then you can click the scan button and it will do a full scan. Scan of this software can take many minutes. Uh, it's not usually an hour or more. Um, most of the computers that I've scanned from my clients um, took anywhere from, I don't know, 5 to uh, 30 minutes maybe to download. And uh, once you uh, have the software, it's going to you know, check for suspicious things. Like here it says, well, there's something suspicious here. Uh, maybe your computer has something wrong um, and it will in this case I know that it's okay uh, but it you know has colors to display stuff um, it has green means everything is okay it has gray which means it's not really sure uh, it just doesn't know it has orange like this that it thinks it's suspicious it thinks there could be something wrong but once again it's not sure and um, there's red which is officially very very bad so once things are detected uh, you have the registry you have um, you know uh, I'm just gonna change it to English here you have the tasks the host file uh, anti root kit files folders and it's gonna check the master root record and the web browsers and so you can right click and select everything that it detected that's wrong and click the delete button afterwards 
Once it's done that, uh, reboot your computer and uh, hopefully some of the malware that was plaguing your computer are gone. Um, like I said, this is made to be used in conjunction with something else. So you don't use Rogue Killer alone for malware. You'll use it with a good antivirus or also, um, for example, my favorite combination is using Rogue Killer with malware bytes uh, from malwarebytes.org and usually together they're probably close to 95 percent of malware and um, of course take a look through our videos we'll have a series of videos on the malwares so we'll have a lot of little tips and tricks things that people don't actually know about malware um, also that are very useful to remove and uh, so hopefully this will help you fix your computer and remove any viruses. If you enjoy our videos, want to subscribe to our channel, you'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions on what you've seen, let us know. Maybe you have a feature of Windows 8. Maybe you have a problem, something you would like us to help you with. Let us know. We'll try to help you. And hopefully, you will come back to the official Windows 8 channel. Thank you for watching.